on August 9, 1995, at 4.23 a.m., eight days after his 53rd birthday, Garcia was found dead in his room at the rehabilitation clinic. The cause of death was a heart attack. Garcia had long struggled with drug addiction, weight problems, sleep apnea, heavy smoking, and diabetes all of which contributed to his physical decline. Lesh remarked that upon hearing of Garcia's death, I was struck numb, I had lost my oldest surviving friend, my brother. Garcia's funeral was held on August 12, at St. Stephen's Episcopal Church in Belvedere. It was attended by his family, the remaining Grateful Dead members, and their friends, including former basketball player Bill Walton and musician Bob Dylan, and his widow Deborah Coons, who barred Garcia's former wives from the ceremony. On August 13, a municipally sanctioned public memorial took place in the polo fields of San Francisco's Golden Gate Park, and was attended by approximately 25,000 people. Crowds produced hundreds of flowers, gifts, images, and a bagpipe rendition of Amazing Grace in Remembrance. In the hate, a single white rose was reportedly tied to a tree near the dead's former Ashbury house, where a group of followers gathered to mourn. On the morning of April 4, 1996, after a total lunar eclipse earlier that day, Weir and Deborah Coons, accompanied by Sanjay Mishra, spread half of Garcia's ashes into the Gangs River at the holy city of Rishikesh. India, a site sacred to Hindus. The remaining ashes were poured into the San Francisco Bay. Coons did not allow one of Garcia's ex-wives, Carolyn Mountain Girl Garcia, to attend the spreading of the ashes.